welcome back to the big fat psychic channel i'm so pleased to be reading again for you today okie dokie so uh oh dear i have to say this so my uh, tyndall was not in the army and not a veteran uh so I apologise for that, but the reading still stands. And another little snippet as well. I don't know if anybody uh, noticed, but I I was busy all weekend with the children, my grandchildren. And so, I, you know, we all stay off our phones, we don't even have the TV on. We just play games and get up to all sorts. Uh, and anyway, uh, I checked my email last night to find that uh, both my, uh, the last ones about Mike Tingle <laughs> been demonetized so anyway i've appealed against it now this is based on that it was a copy copyright issue apparently uh with my comedy theme tune which is at the end um so that's really uh funny that because i've got over nearly 1200 videos uh, that are on and uh, they all have uh that music okay now it was this two and there was a one uh, a few weeks ago or maybe a couple of months now uh, where it was demonetized as well and so we'll see you know it just seems to it's dodgy it's dodgy as hell that's what i'll tell you <laughs> it's dodgy as hell why you know why one tune on a, a video uh, and not all the rest you know de should demonetize me for all the bloody uh rest of them shouldn't they so yeah we do know uh, somebody didn't like that i'm not gonna say uh or cast aspersions or big myself up uh you know to think that those two reprobates uh, are watching my channel i don't really care don't give an f to you <laughs> i don't anyway i'll win i won the last one so i'll uh, win this one as well so that apparently it's gone back up uh, temporarily uh, and they'll let me know the outcome the cheek of it the cheek of it so when they're doing stuff like that uh, on videos it just fuels me you know to believe that it is you know accurate it will happen um and I won't go on anymore now because I've got <laughs> that's another section, isn't it? Uh, but we'll go on about the king and uh, Harry's visit. But I thought I'd just keep you in the picture, okay? Then, so, um, does Harry uh, intend to meet the king? Well, that's a hard one, okay? So at first I would have said no. But I don't know whether this is like something that he doesn't, you know, he doesn't want to, to get involved or something, you know. Maybe he doesn't want to get involved. Maybe he sees it uh, as pointless, you know. Does Harry see it as pointless going to see his dad? Nothing's changed. There's no big change. You know, it's not being called over here uh, or requested uh, by the king. Uh, you know, nobody's in touch with him. I mean, I imagine King Charles is uh, st still a little uh, very careful uh, as well, but a little involved. I've, I've always sensed that that there is like something, whether it's messages or just updates or a calendar. It doesn't have to be a full-on conversation. Um, but yeah, so uh, things not going his way, you know, things not going his way. Let me just see about the king. Does the king, uh, you know, intend to meet Harry? You know, I don't know if the king is uh, going to spend time with Catherine, okay? Um, I always got these mixed, always, I don't know why I get them mixed up, but I do feel like this could be, uh, so the, he's loyal to Catherine, you know, um, especially after what's gone on. I mean, you'll think, you know, she's, uh, she's a, a very poorly girl at the moment, and... She had all that with the pictures and, and Getty and then, uh, you know, all the accusations. But, I mean, that's long term in the past. But I think the recent staring up of the internet, uh, you know, King Charles would suspect uh, Harry's hand in it. Well, of course, because you've got Boozy, you've got uh, Ermage, you know, all the people that they knock about with. 
So is this that he's not going to get his own way? Does he intend to? I don't think... Are there any plans in place for the king to see Harry? It's up to, you know, it's uh, the king, it's not, it's for the king to decide, not for Harry, okay, so um, it, it's for the king to decide. So I think as a, a father, you know, uh, he would see Harry maybe and also with Camilla in the room and if, uh, you know, he says that Camilla's going to be there, is Harry, you know, uh, he knows he can't, uh, so like get his dad on side. Because there's another influence there. So, you know, I do believe, and I did say before, uh, that Cam Camilla was in the room. Even if it was uh, for a few minutes and she said uh, uh, she'd leave. But, you know, I don't know here. This is, uh... well, it's definitely not looking good for Harry. And it's looking on strength of it. Uh, you know, the king has pl plans as well and duties. You know, I don't know, I'm getting... I'm getting mixed vibes. Okay, so let's say the king has. So is the king, yes or no? Just be simple here. Yeah, What's turn the card over? I promise. <laughs> Last few missed words. Anyway, but yes or no, uh, you know, uh, will Harry and King... Uh, have a meeting while he's over here at the Invictus yes now I'm glad they said that because I'll tell you why the king if you remember a few weeks ago I said the king needs to speak to Harry uh, about African parks maybe and telling him something that he doesn't want to, to know that he won't like, you know, about stepping back. So it's either stepping back from Invictus or stepping back from uh, what you call it, uh, African parks as well. You know, we've got a lot of uh, damage uh, going on here because of Harry and Meghan being associated uh, with these both. You'd think the humanitarian in Meghan would, uh, you know, want to go over uh, and uh, take control and sort out this African parts, you know. Uh, if she wants to, uh, you know, control the world as a, a president, then, you know, this would be uh, an ideal example. <laughs> oh, no, honestly. Honestly. OK, right. So let's have a look then. What does the king want to speak to Harry about? About lies, about the lies, okay, about being exposed as well, like, you know, uh, lies are going to be revealed, uh, about their lies as well. Now, this must be uh, pretty big, you know, this kind of lie, uh, because this face-to-face -face could already have been in the making for a while now, okay, uh, a, a while. But, yeah, it's about uh, their lies. And how will they, uh, you know, because uh, we'll, we'll ask about a few other things the king wants to, to say, but, you know, how will Harry respond to the king uh, about, cover, you know, covering his tracks? What will Harry say? What is response to be uh, to the king telling him about lies that are going to be exposed? How will Harry feel? Oh, look at that. Look at that. He's absolutely devastated. Okay, uh, devastated. But is it that people uh, that Harry has been overseeing? You know, like this African park, so the bloody uh, Invictus. Do you know what? I've got a feeling this is somewhere else. Um, but yeah, so we've got uh, very upset here. It's not a pleasant conversation. It's a difficult one. And do you know what? I said this uh, a few readings back. Uh, so uh, for you, for those uh, <laughs> that like to, you go back and find it for me. Um, but yeah, so uh, oh dear, oh dear, honestly. What are these, uh, you know, what else does the king want to say to uh, Harry? That, you know, 
know, everything's up in the air, nothing's there, decided just like that, you know, everything, uh, and the waiting, uh, that he wants to talk about them waiting uh, from news that's going to come elsewhere, so it's not from the royal family, uh, so there could be breaking news uh, from elsewhere uh, and a decision. There's something like a, a, a leg. So you've got your hands tied, aren't you, behind your back, uh, your, your leg behind, behind you, or up, leg up. You see, we've got the uh, Commonwealth uh, reefer as well, so, you know. Could it be Nigeria, you know, because they're rushing off and he's rushing off his hurry and going elsewhere. I mean, that timing is suspect. Don't you think, you know, uh, the, the run up to it? Absolutely disgraceful. Why do you have to go? Uh, why can't you stay for the full invest, uh, Invictus Games? And why can't you just let them have that few days or a week, whatever it is, uh, to have all the PR and everything? But no, Meghan and Harry, uh, you know, now it'll be us flying in where and flying over England. And, you know, will uh, Harry see the king? Will he snub William? You know, it's anything but uh, about the Invictus Games. Uh, and I feel as well there could be some uh, discussion regarding that as well. How will, uh, you know, Harry uh, react to this then? He's going to have to agree to something, okay? He's going to have to agree. It's not in a losing sense or anything. This is like, you know, behind the scenes kind of management, uh, damage control maybe. But, you know, he's going to have to agree to it and look happy uh, as well. You know, look uh, unbothered. Okay, so now I want to know is, uh, will the King uh, make inquiries with Harry about African parks? Will they have that discussion about what's going on? I feel they'll have a discussion about a woman who was destructive. So maybe a woman who could be trouble for Harry, you know, uh, a woman who could be trouble for Harry. Is King Charles going to discuss the bullying claims? Yes or no? No. Why is Harry going to be so upset about this? Because it's happening fast as well, you know. It's happening uh, fast. Get a younger male, very charming, very charming. Oh dear. <laughs> oh no. Is this to do with Mike Tyndall? <laughs> well, you know, Harry, you've got so much on with your uh, industrial complexes and your uh, travel and your Invictus and your African parks and all them uh, awards and your aviation uh, and then the uh, army guys, you know. Oh, you've got a lot on your polo as well. You've written your book spare. I mean, I have to say he's done a lot on, but he's, you know, he's created a bed and for his own back. I don't know. It could be. I 
I think, you know, where Harry's tried to look good uh, at doing something, it's become a burden now, okay, so it's become a burden. Now, like I say, sometimes the story is, uh, you know, it's the words that count, uh, not the story, whether it's in, uh, in Victor's Instagram <laughs> uh, or anything else, you know, African parks, but there is something uh, there uh, which he is going to be deeply, deeply unhappy about. And again, what you've got as well, you've got to be careful with Harry because he sees himself as a victim all the time and he's not a victim. He just, uh, oh, I don't know, it just... Is the opposite, isn't he? He's a bully. Right, what does uh, Harry want to talk to his dad about? You know, one of the one thing, please. So Maybe about trickery and deceit, okay? So you don't lay the cards on the table. Uh, you uh, making out that you're something when you're not. Making out they're okay, but they're not. Making out they're okay, but they're not. So Harry could be making out everything's okay, you know, and going, uh, okay, uh, yeah, his father... Uh, has probably had news uh, from a lot of people uh, regarding Harry and this isn't going away this isn't going away so what does he want to talk about about uh, trickery, deceit you know uh, making out he's the victim and that things aren't going uh, so well conflict why well, does harry say something and then does the opposite you know the complete turnaround to what you would expect got the king uh back in catherine I just see a woman who could be a threat here, okay? Uh, a woman who could be a threat. How does the king feel about Harry and Meghan's trip to Nigeria? Well, that was Meghan's idea, you know, very clever, very cunning. Uh, that is Meghan's card, so this one is a different lady. Yeah, she's using every trick in uh, the book. By now, you've probably uh, uh, saw the royal grift uh, with her uh, messages regarding uh, the Commonwealth and also Lady C as well. Um, but we're going to do, you know, we'll, we'll look at that in a, another reading. I've got like, I want to know what they, you know, what, what they will be successful at uh, and what they will fail at. Okay. Anyway, we're getting off the subject. So, yeah, she's a. Uh, She's very clever, isn't she, and cunning, and, uh, well, you know, uh, let's see if you're clever enough, love, to fake your genealogy uh, reports. And I hope they show more information than your baby scan did. Yeah, he knows, uh, you know, Harry wouldn't have thought of all that by himself at all. She can handle it herself, you know, uh, she's tungsten, isn't she? I think that's what he said about her. What does Harry fear uh, about talking to his dad? Having to apologise, you know, uh, needing things to be put right. You know, right, whatever, whatever it is, this, it's the right thing to do. Forgiveness is a powerful uh, thing. It's uh, it it lightens you as well. Um, it can make you feel good. It can make you uh, feel more positive about the future. It can help you overcome the past as well. So you know, I am seeing uh, he's wanting 
whether it's a you know as well as forgive others you have to forgive yourself first as well I still sense that, you know, Harry is making out everything is okay and it's clearly, clearly not. And the king is aware. I just see that, you know, his fears, his fears. Well, he won't get his apology, will he? You know, he won't get his apology. So he can't, he's been stamping his feet. Demanding an apology. Well, you won't get it. Okay, so, you know. Does Camilla uh, believe that, you know, the king will meet with Harry? No. Maybe he has things on then, you know, but these are the things that I'd like to talk about. So uh, there's no plans really in place here. I mean, you can't have a conversation with him, can you, on the telephone maybe? Camilla definitely uh, doesn't think so. Uh, what about Catherine? Uh, does Catherine feel that, you know, does Catherine believe the king will meet with Harry? Well, here it's saying no then, you know, uh, as if like there might be some communication But you're a liar, Harry. You're a liar. Saying one thing and doing another. I mean, Catherine, she doesn't have the energy anyway, you know. I mean, she won't see her. Uh, she won't see Harry. And neither will William. Does William believe uh, the king will see Harry? Well, no, because everybody's afraid of, uh, you know, Megan and how she twists things. Well, there's too much here for him not to see each other. Last two, can't, no, I won't say last two. Right, so let's go for it. Uh, will Harry uh, see his father? Yes. How will the king, you know, uh, will the king uh, see Harry? So you get a yes, uh, 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 you know, on part. Uh, I get Harry celebrating, but I get the uh, the king like it, undercover. Undercover. Do you know what? It's as if uh, I see Harry waiting somewhere. Yeah, I feel like I see Harry waiting somewhere. And then I see uh, like a door open maybe. I don't know, maybe I'll pick that up in uh, the, the looking back section.
Okay, right. So what will be the outcome then for Harry uh, and his trip to see, uh, his hopes to see th the king? It's, well, it does. It does. It does. It does. I think, uh, you know, Harry will also feel maybe a, a, a lot happier. You know, maybe because when you haven't spoke to somebody for a while or things have been difficult and there's been like separation, um, it feels awkward beforehand. So you get yourself all stressed up and anxious and everything. Uh, and then when you see this person or you have a conversation, uh, it kind of melts away. So I can feel that's how Harry will feel. What's the outcome for the king, please? So there's a, you know, there's reasons as well. There's reasons why the king would want to see harry not a makeup you know breakup kind of thing but you know there's a there's things going on uh that need to be said uh and discussed and talked about and i really don't think uh you know i know invictus games is a, a big thing but i don't think it's actually to do with the invictus games It could also be, you know, something personal, what's going on with uh, the king. What will be the outcome uh, for the king seeing his son, Harry? Again, like, you know, Harry hasn't grown up. Harry hasn't matured. Uh, Harry hasn't changed his stance on things, you know, uh, still that sense of entitlement, you know, I want, I want, I want. So I just feel like, you know, again, uh, the king is disappointed in Harry, uh, certainly with the last visit as well. It was very short, but Harry was there, capping and Now, it might not have been for uh, money, but it was for help as well. You can't, you know, I see him kind of saying, you can't save yourself, you know. Like, no one can save you, Harry. You have to do this for yourself. And so, like, wasting energy as well, precious uh, energy. I don't think... Uh, so I get defend, defend, defend. Well, the king can't defend Harry anymore. Well, the... Because uh, I haven't seen a mother card in... Oh, yeah, that one, but she's not a mother, is she? Uh, so, you know, will... The king and Harry have words about... Uh, the surrogate surrogacy issue which is now like you know it's out there into uh lady c's done it you've got loads of youtubers thing is they're not they're not media uh, okay so um and like even talk and g gb news they don't uh go uh that far as well so but you know uh will they have a conversation about it absolutely Every move you make, every move, that's what I was hearing, it's a song. Uh, every move you make, so, you know, it's like, tried to warn you, Harry, tried to warn you, you know, we was biting at your heels uh, and you just stormed off and, and took a path into the unknown. You had no idea. You look foolish. Um, and it's like, what on earth was you thinking? For some reason, people are more concerned about Archie, okay? Got to do something differently, you know? You've got to do something uh, differently. So these two uh, are 
it will come up and it is chatting because it is like well that but demanding things you know he wants uh charles to get involved uh, and uh, start shutting people down or using his influence i don't know what world this uh, guy lives in you know just because he pulls these stunts doesn't mean to say that you know uh, king charles does in the near future the very near future will there be talk of a new pregnancy for Harry. Yeah, I think there's talk of it. You know, they're going to do the speculation thing, aren't they? Uh, uh, and put out there because she's not. She's not. Well, I didn't expect that, but that's communication. So we're probably going to, you know, hear of it. Uh, lies, you know. It's like, can you imagine if Meghan was going to announce she was pregnant? What the king would say to Harry right now? Well, it wouldn't be good, would it? I think it's just all talk. It's to interrupt, so, you know, this uh, could be debated again in the future about having a, another baby. Maybe, I don't know, I, I just don't know how this woman thinks. I would be scared to death to make a move or to do anything, uh, you know. It's so close, you know, it's so close. Does Harry feel like a... Why would you announce a, a pregnancy uh, for Meghan when it's you can't think what's going on? You know when it's out of uh, late lady season. Uh, well, you know Meghan, she likes to uh, you know dig about uh, as well. No, maybe uh, being 43% Nigerian uh, as Giffy, uh, what is it, over his uh, some strength, I don't know, I think there's talk about it, you know, definitely talk about it, so whether it be a pregnancy in the past or a pregnancy in the future, I don't feel like that's going to, uh, you know, slightly be discussed is uh the king gonna say that archie's birth certificate is a fake look at that ace of wands ace of wands so you know ace of wands Ace of Wands. Well, you know, the the negative attention and everything that's uh, been coming through. Uh, they've got a lot more letters as well. So let's keep writing um, and uh, make sure our voices are heard. Um, so, yeah, this isn't good, is it? And when uh, there'll be talk about uh, why they changed the birth certificate as well. I think there's a few things that the king wants, uh, you know, to talk to Harry with. I do believe, hand on heart, that Harry will see his father um, only because of past readings. But when it comes to Harry coming over here, I'm shocking. <laughs> so, yeah, I'm getting a... Uh, he can't help. He can't help with the, the press. This could be also Harry having to um, set the record straight, you know, uh, and be forgiven by the public as well you know be sure yourself uh who you are to the public i think one thing i learned far too late in life is that what you show people is all that they see you know so if you put out a uh, I don't, well i'm not going to use examples but <laughs> you know yeah if you was uh unkempt and uh you know depressed and low uh, and anxious and lived in your pajamas uh for years on end 
that's all people will say you know they won't read your mind uh, they won't know your background they won't care about your education or where you worked uh, that's all they say so i have said this to a couple of people uh, in my life you know uh, and tried to explain uh, very gently uh, that what you put out that's all that people see even the way you talk the way you dress you know uh, if you're low, uh, it, you know, pe people see that. If you're vulnerable, people see that. And I think that's, you know, that's what the king is trying to say to Harry, you know. what the, They don't care about anything else but what you see, what you put out and how you portray yourself. I mean, I'm a, a big... Uh, fault as well you know because well you know <laughs> swearing non-swearing you know uh laughing at things maybe uh that are inappropriate you know i don't know uh coming across unhelpful maybe i don't loads i'm guilty i'll be guilty of a lot of things uh as we all are okay but yeah it's just uh yeah if you see the milkman and he brings you milk every day uh and it doesn't matter what time of it is that you're in your pyjamas. Well, I think, oh, they'll walk away and think you lazy git, you know. Uh, she's always sat in the same space. And I know that because that did happen to me a few years, well, many years ago, actually, you know. Uh, I did. I suffered a, a little bit with depression. So, you know, uh, so, yeah, that's uh, that's what I learned. <laughs> okay. And, you know, it, if the more truthful and honest you are, the less you care what people uh, say or think. Um, but yeah, for Harry, uh, this is this is going to be a big subject, uh, I think. So I think we'll uh, stop there. I mean, you know, all about Harry and his uh, dad. Uh, and obviously i'll move on to things that we've picked up on so we will look at nigeria uh we'll we'll look at uh, the king's reaction to lady c's book uh, and uh, lots of other things okay right bye now bye bye